Hello Scorpios, welcome to my channel. My name is Sally and this is going to be a love reading from the 15th to 30th of August 2020. This is going to be a general love reading so it may not resonate with you. I want to thank those that subscribed to my channel, those that liked my video, those that booked personal reading with me. I'm truly grateful. Thank you very much. So Scorpio, I've already shuffled your cards. Let's begin. So as this is a general reading, everything may not resonate with you. If you want to book a personal reading for your own situation, then you have to check the description box. All the information you need is there. So let's begin, Scorpio. Let's begin. So at the bottom of your deck here, we have the Knight of Wands. So I feel like, Scorpio, someone is really passionate about you. Someone wants to come forward towards you. They want to approach you. This person could be a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. But I feel like at this time, there is some kind of delay going on because while I was shuffling your cards, I was hearing delay. So I feel like there is some kind of delay that, is, that has been happening in your love life. And I feel like this delay has been happening for a while. I feel like there's something that is are supposed to happen in your love life. You're supposed to have been in a committed situation with someone someone has supposed to have returned back into your life but i feel like right now there is some kind of delay that is happening in your love life well i feel like this person whomever this fire sign is it doesn't have to be a fire sign they are really really passionate about you with a knight of wands here this person has a lot of passion and desire for you i feel like this was person that was non-committer for some of you uh scorpio you could have been dealing with someone that uh, was non-committer i feel like this commitment could have happened before now but this person was non-committer they were in the night of uh, one's energy this person i feel like your relationship perhaps been going through um a hot and cold phase today the passion is really high and tomorrow the fire has burned down i feel like that's what you have been going uh that's what you have been going through in your relationship so let's see what's in the rest of the card here we have the hermit i feel like you'll be dealing with the virgo it doesn't have to be we have the ten of sword we have the um, Wheel of Fortune. I feel like whomever you're dealing with Scorpio, um, within that time, within the 15th to 30th of September, I feel like this person, they will be really um, be thinking about the whole situation. This person will be thinking about things, how things turned out in your relationship. They'll be thinking about the role they played that things had to happen the way it happened. But right now, I see that currently this person is really disappointed. If you're dealing with an S and Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, I feel like this person is really disappointed at this time. This person is um, feeling betrayed, they are feeling hot. Or this could be you feeling this, but I feel more it's your person that is feeling this. This person is taking inventory of everything that's happened in this relationship. And they are disappointed on the way they had they handled things in this relationship. This really is really this person is really disappointed in themselves at this point. And they wish that they can change things between the both of you. They wish that there is still time there. With this time uh, glass, this hourglass, this person will wish that there is still time to work on this relationship. They feel like they could, um, th this person will wish that they could take back the hands of time. That if things were to go back to um, before, that they will make another decision. They will uh, make, um, they will make a different decision. That is how this person is feeling. We have the eight of sword. Ah, this person is really trapped in their own mind. And I feel like that is causing delay in this situation because obviously they want to come forward here. But I feel like this person is trapped in their own mind. They are afraid. They are scared. They feel stuck in whatever situation they are in. I feel like some of you, this person could be in a prison. That is what I get. I feel like this person could be in a prison right now. It doesn't have to be. It take what resonates with you. I feel like this person could be in a prison. Or they are at a place whereby they are really focused on themselves right now. Because I'm seeing someone that is being caged. Like this um, building here really caught my feeling. Like someone that is in a fortress that has been isolated from the whole world. I feel like this person could be um, isolating themselves. They could be thinking about the decision they have made in life so far. I mean, in regards to your relationship, man, it's really disappointing to this person. We have the fool. This person is trusting and hoping that one day they will, um, they will be free. Like, they feel like this person, I'm, I'm hearing guilt. This person is guilty. They feeling they, they feel guilty for whatever um, decision that they have made so far, and they want to free themselves from this guilt. They want to rectify things. They want to work on things. They want to be able to free themselves. This person is thinking of ways to make this happen with you. We have the three of us all here. This person is really really heartbroken. This person is seriously in pain. This person is seriously in pains. Yeah, the three of sword, the ten of sword. And the eight of sword the hermit no this person is 
definitely in pains. This person is heartbroken right now. Whoever your person is, they are they are really heartbroken right now. They are really heartbroken. I fly like Scorpio. Some of you you found out the truth about this person and you decide to put the situation to rest. You decide to let the situation be. And I feel like um as you have decided to put the situation to rest, you have decided to let this person and this relationship be. I feel like this person is beginning to realize their mistake. They are beginning to realize their errors. And I feel like at this point, this person right now, uh, they are not in a good space. Your person is not in a good space right now. We have the three of pentacles. Okay, this could be, this could have been um a third party situation. That's the message I'm getting for some of you. This could have been a third party situation. I feel like this person walked away from you. Yes, they walked away from you. This person could have chosen someone else over you. They thought that um, the grass was greener on the other side. We have the high priestess here at the bottom of your deck. I feel like this person thought like that um, they thought that the grass was greener on the other side, so they had to let you go. But I feel like this person, they do regret their decision at this time. Is that how you cut this person out or this person cut you out, whatever the case, they regret this person really do regret their decision. I feel like for some of you, there is no communication between the both of you. You guys are not communicating. I feel like you, Scorpios, you walked away from this person. With the Eight of Cups here, definitely you walked away from this person. This person is really worried about you. They are really worried about the connection. They are thinking of ways to bring balance into this situation. They want to invest in this situation. They want to have victory with you. This person could be a fire sign. It doesn't have to be. But I feel like this person is keeping an eye on you. This person is keeping an eye on you. I feel like this person is really frustrated and angry at this time because they feel like like you're no longer accessible like you used to be this person i feel like this person could be your soulmate take what resonates with you i feel like this person they want to come back to you with the ace of cups here they want to be in union with you but i feel like they are very conflicted they are very confused this person could be involved with someone else your person could be with someone else at this time but i feel like they do have feelings for you with the queen of cups here they they had options but they choose uh, someone else over you and i feel like you saw the reality of this person and the situation and you decide to put the whole situation to rest but the thing is that this person they want a new beginning with you they do they do want a new beginning with you they want to bring balance in into this situation but in for some reason this person is trapped i feel like whomever they are with they feel trapped with this person already this person feels trapped i feel like your, the, whomever your person is with is keeping your person trapped it's keeping your person trapped. This person do not have um, the freedom they used to have with you. I feel like when it comes to you, this person was very free. They, they, get, they were very free. Like they can express themselves. They can be themselves. But I feel like with, with this um, other person they are with, they can't do that. They are not free with this person. I feel like, you see, this person is wishing that things was different at this point. They are wishing that things was different. They are, they are looking at the decision that they have made so far and they are disappointed in themselves and the decisions that they have made. This person could be literally crying at this time. This person is crying. Um, I feel like this person, yeah, they, they want to escape. They want to run away from the other person. This person wish that they could escape from this other person. They feel like, but in, for some reason, this person feel like it's too late to do that. This person, they, they are thinking about, this person feels sorry for themselves. They really do feel sorry for themselves. I feel like your person could be thinking of being with you, um, having sex with you. They miss you. They meet that part about the relationship. So let's try, try to get more insight. Holy Spirit, why is the permit here for Scorpios? Their love life. Why is it? Yeah, the eight of course. Yeah, this person is thinking about you, Scorpios. They are thinking about you. They are deeply thinking about you. I feel like you, you are the one that walked away from this situation. You were very patient with the situation. This person was trying to get control over you. They were trying to manipulate you. And I feel like this person really did hurtful things to you. They really said hurtful things to you. And I feel like um you made that conscious decision to walk away. I think this person is thinking of coming back into your life to bring back apology. They want to offer you some kind of apology. I feel like Scorpio, you are at that space in your life where you're very strong um, and independent at this point, at this time. You're fine without this person at this time, Scorpio. You're fine without them. Whether they come back to you or not, you're okay. You're doing your own thing. Why is the Ten of Swords here? Why is the Ten of Swords here for Scorpio? We have the Empress. Okay. So some of you, I feel like this person, they miss that nurturing energy that comes with you. They miss that love that comes with you. Well, the Queen of Cups here. They miss that love that comes with you. This person, they, they, they know, they are beginning to realize that you love them very much. They are beginning to realize that. And they feel disappointed. They are like, how couldn't I see that this person loved me very much? How did I not see that this person loves me so much? I feel like some of you could have children with this person. Yeah, you could have children with this person. Why is it um we love fortune here for Scorpio? We have the three of one. This person is waiting for the perfect time to jump out from whatever situation they are with. Yeah, they are waiting for that perfect time to jump out of whatever situation. They feel trapped already in this situation. 
Why is the Eight of Swords here? Why is the Eight of Swords here for Scorpios? Why is the Eight of Swords here, Holy Spirit? We have the Five of Pentacles. Oh my God, Scorpio, your person is not in a good uh, space at all. This person could be an air sign. They could be a fire sign. They could be an earth sign. This person is not in a good place at all mentally. They, they miss you so much. They miss you. They miss you. Why is the Four here? Okay, this person, they are waiting for the right time to jump out of this situation. Like I said before, they are finding courage to end whatever situation they are into. I feel like this person already um, started something, committed with someone else, and now they regret. They are waiting for the right time to jump out and end whatever situation they are into right now. If they are with someone else, I feel like the relationship with that person is not going really well at this time. It's not going really well. This person wants a new beginning with you, Scorpio. Why is it three of swords here for Scorpio? Their love life. Why is the three of sword here? Why is the three of sword here for Scorpio, Holy Spirit? Okay, we have the chariot. <laughs> Scorpio, this person could be a cancer. It doesn't have to be. I feel like whomever this person is, I feel like um this person right now, they want to come back to you. Yeah, like I said before, this person wants to come back to you. I feel like this person, they are heartbroken, one, because of the decision they have made in the past. And I feel like the another reason why they are heartbroken, they are heartbroken because they feel foolish at this time. They feel, they feel very foolish. They feel like, okay, why didn't I realize earlier how much this person loved me or how much this person means to me? The person is not in a good space right now. This person is going through a lot. The person is going through a whole lot. Yeah, they are going through a whole lot. This person, they want to reach out to you. They want to communicate with you. This person could be thinking of offering you an apology. They could be thinking of offering you an apology. Why is the three of pentacles here for Scorpio's Holy Spirit? We have the ace of sword. Okay. So, um, Scorpio, your person, they are thinking of cutting out the other person. But I feel like now they just have to stay in that situation that is very unbearable for them because they feel like this is not the right time to do that. That was why I was getting delay from the beginning of your reading. I feel like this person feel like this is not the right time to make any kind of foolish move unless uh, they feel like this is not the right time to make any kind of foolish move because right now, they don't have what it takes to leave this relationship. This person could be in this relationship for financial reasons. They could be trapped with this person for financial reasons. I feel like whoever they are dealing with, I'm getting the message that for some of you, whomever your person is dealing with, this person has a lot of money. And I feel like um, they feel like they need to be financially independent before they can leave this person. And I feel like this person is staying in whatever relationship they are in because of money. But they miss you very much. They do miss you. They miss you so much. Why is the Ace of Wands here for Scorpio? Why is the Ace of Wands here for Scorpio? Holy Spirit. We have the Sun, yeah. This person, excuse me. <coughs> excuse me, I'm having cold. Sorry. <coughs> Sorry, okay. So, with the Sun here, I feel like this person, they want to have happiness with you. They want to have happiness with you. They miss what they used to have with you. This person miss that so much. I feel like, oh, like I said before, with you, this person is very free. They can be themselves. But with this other person, they feel caged. They feel trapped. They feel like they can't do the things they want to do. I feel like this person has gained to that control of your person. This is not a very good time for your person, Scorpio. Why is the Six of Sword here? Scorpio love reading. Why is the Six of Sword here? Scorpio, Scorpio, Scorpio love reading, Holy Spirit. Why is the Six? Okay. We have the emperor so this person they are going to fight they are going to come out of this situation they are going to fight i feel like scorpio you at this point in your love life you're just letting things be you're trusting the universe you're like i'm hearing what's gonna be is gonna be i feel like that's the state of mind that you're in right now what's gonna be is gonna be so what's good for you we come to you, Scorpio. I feel like that is the headspace that you are into right now. But I feel like your person is not in a very good place. I feel like, Scorpio, you are in a very um, stable mental space. Like, you are focusing on your own self and you are growing your own self. You are letting go of what is no longer saving you. You are putting an end to things that is no longer working for you. But your person is in a very disturbed um, space right now. This person could be having mighty depression because they want out of whatever situation they are in. But they feel like they can't leave that situation now. And I feel like that is causing delay. This person is anticipating when they are going to be with you, they, when they are going to talk to you. This person could be spying on you. They could be keeping an eye on you in one way or the other. They could be keeping an eye on you through mutual friends or through social media, however the case may be. But this person is counting time. They are counting the hours. They are counting the minutes when they are going to be with you. This person, they couldn't sleep at night. They don't sleep at night. They are thinking about everything that have went down in this relationship and they know the, the part they played 
they feel responsible they feel guilty for everything that has happened in this situation this person just wants to rush back into your life that's what they want they want to be free they want to be free with you but i feel like this person is in a very disturbed um space right now they are very sad they could be going through depression they are they are not in a very healthy uh, mental space this person feel lonely they feel angry they feel sad all they want is to be with you so scorpio that is all i have for you if this reading resonates don't forget to like don't forget to subscribe don't forget to leave a comment to let me know how this resonates and if you want to book a, a personal reading with me remember all the information is in the description box and i will see you in my next video bye